And here's the latest thing I read in Art Magazine um, uh, for baby, us baby boomers. We've got baby boomers out there. The latest thing I read, um, we're doing medical tattoos. We are tattooing medical instructions on our chest, like DNR, do not resuscitate, or no CPR. So if we're walking down the street and we drop dead, the medical people will know what to do. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I'm going to do that too. I'm going to tattoo PMSBO. I'm going to put my shirt back on. <laughs> nope, I still don't have PMSBO tattooed on my body. Which brings me to another comedy writing tip. Exaggeration. Comedy is all about extremes. Someone isn't 100 years old, they're 1,000 years old. They don't weigh 200 pounds, they weigh 2,000 pounds. So next time you're trying to come up with something funny, exaggerate it. That Super Bowl commercial about herding cats we had a few years ago was funny because of its outrageousness. Herding cats is impossible and stupid and very exaggerated. So go through your written piece and find places where you can take a fact, a figure, or something mundane and make it bigger. For example, if you have a lot of kids in your family, you could say you've got like a hundred siblings. That's funny because no one has a hundred siblings. You could also make up a funny job, an outrageous hobby, or a crazy addiction. The more obscure and impossible, the funnier it'll be. Or you could toss in a little exaggerated irony, like a diabetic being trapped in a chocolate factory. Be conscious of the adjectives you use and don't miss a chance to make it larger. Hurting cats still cracks me up. Thanks for watching. Check out my blog, comedywriterblog.com, and my book, Finding the Funny Fast. And hope to see you next time.